Hey guys, it's me, Wolverine. That's me as Wolverine in a theater full of people thinking they're watching Deadpool, when actually I rented the entire theater to play an edited version of the movie. The first hour is gonna be completely normal, letting them all settle in before the changes begin. I've made five edits that start subtle and ramp up in craziness until the big reveal when I appear in the movie. And you know how Deadpool talks directly to the audience? Well, in my movie, it's much more specific. Oh, and Johnny? You're a bitch. <laughs> I started by filming some green screen scenes. Wow, Jesus, that's hard to say. Green screen scenes. I got a size too small. Come on, how do superheroes do this? Getting ready to fight crime any minute now. <laughs> do I look like a superhero? This is going to be a disaster to get off. It's so oily. Deadpool flip. Oh! I should have bought the claws on Amazon, but I'm already way over budget. I can't get my claws off and I use scissors as the claws. All right, I'm going to shower. This is stupid. Yeah, so showering didn't work. Then I got started editing the movie. Guys, 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 guys. I just figured out the best thing of all time. Deadpool wears a mask, right? So you can't see his lips. And with the little help from AI, I can make him say whatever I want. Wow, Andrew Levitt is so hot talented and modest. You should really subscribe. I just came up with the best idea. There's a scene where he gets in a taxi. I'm gonna make him say my friend's address. Okay, I just left the theater. We're all booked and good to go for tomorrow. Now I just need to fill it. So I texted some gym friends from CrossFit saying I'm filming a commercial for the movie theater and need to get some clips of people watching a movie. But here's the problem. This isn't the first time I've done this. Last year I pulled the same joke on my girlfriend when we were watching Lord of the Rings. Morris, scum! There's nice work here and he's doing. Come on, you sea rats! Get off your ships! What? <laughs> Why was there a clip of what's his bucket? What? <laughs> So the problem is I don't know if they've seen that video and all it takes is for one of them to get suspicious or to say something to an employee and this whole lie comes crumbling down. And with that, it was finally movie night and the 5 p.m. boys from CrossFit trickled into the theater. I should mention my mom came with my kindergarten teacher, which was really cool until this scene. <laughs> Take me to 4807 drive. And we all know how this turned out. That's, that's my address, 4807 drive. That's a, legitimately my address. What's your address? 4807 drive. But what do you mean? That's what he just said. He said, take me to 4807 drive. Some kinds of anger can't be managed. Like the kind where your year-long plan ends with the wrong guy getting dismembered. That's it. At least I don't do CrossFit like the gym bros in the front row. Bill, my roommate can lift more than you. God, I miss cocaine. Her. <laughs> fourth wall break inside a fourth wall break. And now with the theater properly warmed up, it was time for the grand finale. Time to show you why you've all really come here tonight. Yes, I'm talking to you, 5 p.m. boys from CrossFit. It's not often you meet a guy as sexy, strong, and talented as Andrew Levitt. He's basically perfect on all levels. Oh my God. And you guys thought you were here to watch Deadpool. No, Deadpool is here to watch you. <laughs> Hey guys, it's me, Wolverine. <laughs> Come on, Wolverine? Wait, why do you sound like Batman? What do you mean? This is just my voice. <laughs> All right, whatever. Come on, it's time to kill some bad guys. Oh, and Johnny, you're a bitch. <laughs> Look, I'm jump roping like Derek. <laughs> So yeah, we all died in a blaze of glory. 
Well, besides me, of course. I went on to live forever alone and depressed. I guess the moral of the story is, don't trust Andrew when he asks you to go to the movies. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Like, how does it end? Does she live? That's how it ends. Everyone <laughs> died. What? I'm invested. Wait, who's Derek? You do? Derek not jump around? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have a really hard time with it, yeah. So I'm pretty sensitive about it. He said my address, and I was like, Andrew, that's my fucking address. <laughs> I left my house, my parents were like, where are you going? And I was like, oh, so one of my boys is a YouTuber. He rented out a whole theater, it's only like a commercial, and yeah. he's like, oh, that's, that's cool. And I was like, yeah, I'm about to be in a commercial. Fuck you, let's go. <laughs> I'm about to go home and I'm gonna be like, yeah, I just got dissed in a movie theater. Hey, Deadpool. What? So we have regenerative healing, right? Ever wonder why we don't harvest our organs and sell them on the black market? They would just regrow. It's like an infinite money glitch.